Ahoy, Krusty Crew! Data here with episode 6 of my 100% walkthrough of Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. In the last episode, we finished off Goo Lagoon and did the Poseidome, and now we are in this new area of Bikini Bottom. So, I don't know if I'm going to start Rock Bottom today, but I would like at least to do Shady Shoals and Sandy's Treehouse. It may be a shorter episode, but just trying to make everything concise and findable as well. On YouTube here, I don't want to pile too many things into one, make it a 40 minute video where you can't find your help. So moving into this next section of Bikini Bottom, we are going to kick it off with Shady Shoals, the current home of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy, where all that crazy stuff took place, where the the, gr the grape juice flooded all the people who had, uh, they opened up the windows to show everyone their new white clothes, the guy burst into the room, what's going on in here, all kinds of great stuff happened at Shady Shoals, great episodes have been here. So let's head in and see what we can do. Probably a couple of golden spatulas, wow, something like that. Come on, Nudge, here they are. My heroes! Hit me with a water ball. Hit me, hit me, hit me. Uh, yeah, we don't do that stuff anymore, kid. We're retired. No. Is that the TV repairman? No, <laughs> it's that excited sponge kid again. Oh. Uh, are you sure he can't fix the TV? He can give it a try. It would be my greatest honor to Let me guess, there's a golden television. spatula on the roof that's uh, getting in the sponge way. Sponge kid. You really want to help out? No, yes. boy, would I? Okay, then. Uh, <laughs> but like oh, okay, the enthusiasm, huh? Uh, you're making my bowels act up. That's not good. Uh, we've got a little problem with some robots down in the Mermelair. No. Are you sure you're up to this task? Absolutely, you better believe it. Absolutely, Barnacle Boy. Well, go over to the couch to access the Mermelair. We'll meet you down there. Is it pudding okay. night yet? Oh, pudding night? I wish. Okay, that sounds good. Let me just quickly run through here. Make sure there's nothing uh, hiding on the rooftops or anything like that. Oh, what? <laughs> what was what was that? I hit the TV and it gave me a sock. Okay, grazie for the sock. Nine. Wow, okay. That was the easiest sock ever. Mm, don't want to do that yet. Don't want to leave. Okay, let's take all these guys out. Got that sock, number 28. Okay, let's head over to the couch here. Uh, which couch is it? No, this couch. Where I'm already... Okay, here we go. What's up, Bells? Enter the mermaid lair? Yes. Oh. Yeah, they really paid some money. Oh, it just slides in. They really paid some money to get this installed. Okay, so here we are in the shmerma lair. Let's start going through, see what we got. Here's a box. Okay, so it seems like this is another area, right? So I won't be getting to rock bottom today, that's for sure. Uh, let's go... What's over here? Don't wanna... Yeah, I just... Okay, that was a bit foolish, but learn my lesson. Okay. What's up, boys? Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Uh, you shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. <laughs> yeah. Come to think of it. Nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your office. Awesome These guys were presence, in great shape in their of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my Where's the dirty bubble and all these other guys? My... All right, kid. <laughs> knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick sat on my old ones. That's Classic. not what I meant. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up. Young sponge of goodness. Nice. It is? It is? Yes. A bunch of evil robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. Aye, aye, aye. It's up to you to shut it down and stop them. Well, why him? We're perfectly Good capable question. superheroes. Because it's Thursday and we Good. have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Ah, also fair. fish sticks. I forgot. Go talk to the Mermelair computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. I accept this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Man. You won't be disappointed. Shamed, maybe, but not disappointed. <laughs> to the doctor's Shameful. office! Away! <laughs> All right, good stuff. Let's keep. Let's start walking through here. Don't step on the red squares of the disco floor. Okay, you got it. Just gotta watch the pattern. Looks like I can, I can just walk through. Yeah, easy. Oh, hey, boys. Bing. Ah, oh, come on. Zip. Is something down here? There is something down here. If I if I had a sponge ball, I could make a. Oh yeah, that's true. I have the um, the bowling capabilities now. So if I just uh, let's go line them up, boys. 
Joey strikes. Zoop. Okay, try it again. Joey strikes. I've been trying to hit this thing with the bowling ball, finally, for like three minutes. Finally got that, which was uh, all for nothing. I got uh, 50 shiny bits, okay. Here's Joey Hams. Oh, uh, ma, I can't even get up. All right, bit of a rocky start here in the Mermelair, but we're going to try it again. I'm not even going to try to destroy that thing. Took forever. Hold on, let these guys explode. What's the message that they have for me here? These poles are power generators. Don't touch them or the energy beam. No problem. Can I make it through? That was a close one. Next. Uh, Roy, yeah, yeah, who's this guy? Cowboy. They don't like sponges, it looks like. Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't want that to happen to me. Okay, they really just have to finish me off, I guess, huh? Well, I'm going to teach this guy a lesson in respect. Here we go. What's up, fellow? Zoop! Like smell of uh, how about that, huh? Hurts your foot? Like oh, where'd you go? Victory. Hey, get up. Don't, don't try and run away from me. Where do you think you're going? Where does he keep flying? He has a bunch of lives or something. You guys think you're funny? Get out of here. Zip, zip, zip. Little doggies. Get on, little doggies. Yeehaw! There we go. Exploded. That got me a nice little amount of shiny bits. Is this the Mermelair computer guy? Lady? You can use Bubble Ball to turn paddle wheels. Bowl one side of this paddle to make it turn. Okay, well, I should see what the computer has to say first, no? Is this not the computer that I have to speak to? He tells me to go talk to a computer. I see a giant computer. This isn't the one. Ooh, here's a bungee, by the way. And I didn't... I couldn't make it... Okay, wow. That was... How am I supposed to get there? I Probably the paddle wheel would have done something if I hadn't jumped to conclusions, literally. Let's try it again. Which way do I have to bowl? This way? Okay, great. Keep bowl. So that's why. That's how I get there. I, I just keep turning that thing. There we go. Okay, one more. There we go. This little wall's trying to hide it from me. Okay, so here's the first hidden thing that this guide would probably help you for. Gives you a sock. Now that that's done, you can turn it back. Beautiful. What's this guy here? Another thing to bowl? Uh, the bowl can also be used to press buttons. Great. This Mermelair is pretty uh, complex. A lot of things to go through. These old guys are just trying to walk around. It's not very accessible for the uh, handicapped individuals here. Beep! Bong! Uh, gold, golden spatula for doing nothing. Okay, thank you very much. Golden spatula number 28. I will take that with a big, big grin on my face. And then this box would transport me back to the beginning of the level. Okay, I guess we're done here. Let's continue to the Mermelair main chamber. The Mermelair. Secret fortress of the wrinkly superheroes, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Nice place. Gotta give it to them. Squidward, am I happy to Squid. see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. No, oh, that's science. never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. <laughs> Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermelair computer. But since you're here now, I'll let you do it. Great. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rods? <laughs> That's a great all point. this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all that? That's a great question. That's what I said. Oh, that's easy. In episode uh. 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and they... Never mind. That's, at least it gave us a good answer for the, um, for the lore. No plot holes on IMDb. Perfect. Now we know the lore. The Bermuda Triangle uh, Bellows. Uh, what's this gonna do? I, can I change into Patrick? No, eh? So I can't lift that watermelon, so I guess I'll have to figure that out at a later time. But for right now, let's move forward and let's do this bubble bowling here. Move on to this little carousel of death. Now there's a, a few different locations. I see there's a bus stop here which allows me to change into Patrick, so I'll go back and take care of that watermelon thing quickly before I forget about it. Hmm, but now the, now the problem is I can't get back there. Huh. Oh, I'll have to use the um, the box to get there. That's what I'll have to do. So next time I find a cardboard box, I'll have to use it to go back to that spot. So not for right now, but I will do that as soon as I find another transportation box. Bing, bing, bong. Okay, I need SpongeBob again for that. So it looks like Patrick won't be super necessary at this juncture.
All right, hit him with a little bit of a bowl. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Mm. It smells like victory. Amen, brother. Uh, will this bring me up? Yes, it will. Perfect. Man, this is a really uh, complex location. Those Bermuda diggers really knew what they were doing. What's this guy want? Now, what do you think you're doing here, Bello? Get out. I'll take the, the, the hit. Left wall jump activated. What? Left wall jump? Uh, I guess that's something that's necessary for later. Ma and now this cowboy's here too? Okay, it's gonna get ugly, Bello. Out of my way. Hit you in the foot. Hit you in the testa. Do whatever I have to do. Get out of here. What do you think you're doing? Go back to Texas. You know what we say about Texas in that episode with uh, Sandy, right? At least they give me a lot of money when he, uh, when he um, explodes. Man, this is, place is very technologically difficult to navigate. You've just met the sponginator. This is a slide? Okay, we love slides. We know what we say about slides. Life is ex as extreme as you want to make it. Fresh, like Underwear. A oh, okay. I'm gonna have to try it again because there's a sock up there. Let's try that one more time. Also, want to hit this button again, I guess. Hold on. Boy. There we go. Right wall jump activated. I'm not sure what that does, but I'm sure I'll find out soon. Let's try to make life extreme as we, as we want to make it once more. Here we go. Another Bang. There's that Patrick. sock. Another one for Patricio. Here's another thing to hit with my bowling ball. Bridge activated. Okay, I guess that was pretty important, actually. So, yeah, I'll go down this road for the moment. Out of my way. Zhoo! That was a close one. Get you out. Gone, gone, gone. So, I guess this was... Maybe this was the wall that got act activated for me to climb up. Patrick says Patrick is here as well. Zip, zip, zip! Like that underwear. Perfect. Make those guys explode. Zip, 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 zip! Climb up there. Me! Golden spatch. Just like that. There is number 29 right there. Beautiful. Making good progress. Almost uh, a third of the way through. So now that there's a, a box there, I could finally change to Patrick. So I'm going to go back down to the bus stop here. But could Patrick climb the walls? I'm not sure if he can. No, he can't. So no point in even having a bus stop here, I guess. All right, so we'll hit this... Oh, Mermelair. You need to press all the override buttons spread uh, throughout the Mermelair. The okay. first one is here. Press oh. the buttons! Got it! When you have pressed Perfect. them all, you should return here to press the master shutdown button. You will be rewarded. Grazie! Return Feed here. me those spatulas. Are you listening to me? Yes. Listening. Got it! Love that voice. This oh, is... Uh, pull around. That's one out of four. Okay. What's that episode where he uses that voice? This is a uh, supreme thirst. You know what I'm talking about? He takes that thing out of his... Uh, that thing of lemonade out of his fridge. You know what I'm talking about with the image here. But made it up to the top. I could... Where would this bring me here? This would bring me... Mermelair Security Tunnel. There's so many different paths to go down. But I'll try to finish off. I gotta get those four buttons down first, at least. Press the Master Shutdown button to lower the bridge to the Villain Containment System area. Sheesh, that's for later. So let's go back and try to find those buttons from down those roads that we haven't gone yet. Over where a Mermaid Man's sitting down there. Now, like, for example, there's Mermaid Man there. This is another path I could go... No, I don't want to do that because there's, there's no point about Patrick. So, let's go ahead and talk to Mermaid Man, watching his shows here you're on TV. You're my hero. Hey! You're yellow! When did that happen? Uh, 2300. Do I fake the Patrick teeter-totter? Yeah. Gonna have to, unfortunately, because that'll give me something. Uh, now is the time where I can change to Patrick. And maybe that'll propel me back to the other side or something. I guess that's how I would get there, because I don't think there's any other way that I could get there, unless there was a... I, got no, a job I don't think there's another box. Somebody who can throw things. That's Leave me. It to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel machines. Uh. Throw, throw the throw fruit. No, Tough directions. throw the throw fruit. Throw the tooth. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. <laughs> I mean, they tend to explode. Okay, here we go. Grab this fruit. Uh, you're saying I could uh, propel myself? Where's that gonna send me? Ooh, hoo, hoo, that's hey, far away. I know you. You're that guy. Hmm. I'm gonna need a lot more power to activate the hydroacoustic Doppler modulator. I mean, this guy's like a Starfleet uh, engineer. You think you can handle this? I could see Squidward's house from up here. 
and he's not wearing any pants. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, wait, he never wears pants. Now, <laughs> listen up. There are eight cylinders over there. If you throw something at the cylinders, it'll turn around to the power side. Turn directions. all eight cylinders around to the power side, and I'll give you a reward. Sorry, oh. what was that? I was watching Squidward. Just start turning those cylinders. What happened to the thing I was going to do for Mermaid Man? It propelled me too far away. Oh, uh, here's another button I have to hit. That's two out of four. I'm gonna go ahead and do that this thing for Mermaid Man first. And then I'm going to do the thing for Barnacle Boy. Okay, so here you just gotta be careful. You can't walk on the red. Zoop, 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 zoop. Ah, gotta go backwards. Ah! This, this thing's gonna explode any second. Toss it, Bell. There we go. Worth it. It gives me an underwear as a reward. I'll take it. Next one here. This seems easy, hopefully. Oh my goodness, cannonballs are- Ah! Okay, how am I supposed to get through there? Let's try it again. Try and- Ah! Try, try to guess and anticipate where it's gonna go. Down to two underwear here, come on. How about this one? Maybe this one's easier. Oh, goodness. Ah! ay 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 Some sort of twisted, uh, carnival game. There we go, that's another one. Just one more, I think, right? Ah! Right, maybe just wait wait and see where it's gonna come. Whoa. Ah, come on! That's because eventually you get too close and you can't anticipate. Oh, I have one underwear left! Gotta be careful. Charge, charge. Oh. Ah! Ah! Haha, <laughs> come on! Hopefully I don't have to redo them all. Okay, at least these are already pressed. I just gotta still trump somehow make it through this cannon. Maybe the secret is going through before you have a watermelon. And like, deactivating it or something. No, it doesn't seem like it, huh? Can I press it without the watermelon? Not even. It's gotta be slick. It's gotta be slick. Come on. Yeah, that's right. You gotta sneak by on the left. It looks like that's how it worked. That should be the last one, right? That's three out of three. And then what did he say to go do? Go talk to him again? There we go. Now I can get some sleep. Perfect. Rest up, Bello. Rest easy. Another me! 30 golden spatulas. That is what we love to see, boys. 30 down, 70 to go. Now we can go up and see Barnacle Boy for what he had uh, what he wanted me to do for him. You need to turn all eight cylinders around to the power side. Throw yes. something at a cylinder. Yes. Okay. Got my uh, some throw fruit for me here, Bell. It's over there. Okay. I have to turn all of them, right? Hold on, first I gotta hit this thing. Boop! All towers. Oh, that's a reset button. Okay. What happens if I throw- Oh, okay, it's like a puzzle. Throwing one will not- Okay, 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 now I understand. It doesn't- not like I have to throw eight things. Uh, hold on. I threw it here, and it turned one, two, three of them here. So if I throw it here, it should turn these three, and if I throw it here, it should- Oh, that's- uh, that's why it's- They try to get you, huh? That's why at least they give you the reset button. Okay, here we go. You come in, buttons on the right, um, the, you throw the first one on the right of the button. Then you take the next one, you throw it on the left of the button. Now you throw it two to the right of the button, this guy that's already turned. Now you throw it to the one that's directly across from the button, right there. Then one to the left of the ones you just did. Come on. Right there. Then two to the right of that one. Then this one here to get all three of these to turn. Is that it? No? And then this one right here. Bang. Oh my goodness, thank you. That took forever. I had to run through it like an algorithm with uh, things in my brain frying. Phew, so let's go back and see Barnacle Boy. Does he have a present for me, I hope, ah, after all that well hard work? Done. Now there's enough power. No what problem. What do you need all that power for? Why my foot bath, of course. Uh, Here, yeah, yeah. have a golden spatula. <laughs> Alright, it was worth it. Golden spatch. Number 31. Keep it up. I don't think there's anywhere to go from here. No, so I'm gonna go ahead and take that ramp back down to the mainland. Just gotta find that, uh, those last buttons for the main computer. Maybe I need to go to this place over here that I was looking at earlier. Because this isn't, it doesn't seem as though there's anything left to do in the Mermelair. In this area, so let's go to the Mermelair security tunnel. Gary, I see you made your way down to the deepest recesses of the Mermelair. Well done. Oh, you took the elevator. Uh, well, how do I get to the top of this room? This looks dangerous. You're right. I bet those tunnels will take me up to the top. Good thinking, Gary. Guy's always thinking. What a scholar. 
Um, unless I had climbed up? No, let's go through this door. Okay, make sure you don't touch the red. Whoop! There we go. Nice little tunnels here. They're a good aqueduct system. The guys who made this really knew what they were doing. Now here you gotta be careful. Slowly make your way through. Just be logical. Don't go where there's blue. Don't be where there's yellow. Zoop, zoop. There we go. Ah, come on. Fresh like a spring breeze. Nice and fresh. Bing bong. I'm gonna get through here. Just gotta jump over. Yeah, nice and easy. Stomp on you. Pick up the red shiny bellows. Another dance floor to go through. Need to watch this guy shooting me at the same time with his tartar sauce. Ah, oh, come on, get out of here. Like a new spawn. This guy's still alive? Okay, now it's gonna get ugly. Oh, my goodness. Hey, how many dance floors do these guys presents. put in? More dance floors than the Club Penguin nightclub. Dance, monkey, dance, monkey, dance, monkey, oh, oh, oh. You gotta go quick over here, it changes fast. Oh, I'm so sick of these tartar sauce guys. <laughs> Lost three underwear, just going through that little section. Now, Cowboy Joey is here with his little doggies. You have to hit it. <laughs> You're a funny guy. How about that? Stomp. Oh, what? Okay, box is open. Okay, here's the last button. Bing. Oh, no, that's three out of four only. Well, another golden spatula. I will take it. They're just handing them out like candy today. That is number 32. That brings me back to the Mermelair, right? Uh, no, it brings me to the rolling ball area. Okay, let me make sure I did everything here first. No, it's not. I did not do everything here. 2300 shiny objects. Take the upper path. You better believe I will pay that. Take this path up here. All right, now we're going to the treadmills here. Oh, you got to be careful. Zoop, zoop. Yep, you got to just go around town. Oh, ah! All right, come on! Make you fall so far. Get out of my way. At least you can go in that uh, cardboard box and just come back right up to the top. Because if I had to walk back each time, that would be a long trip. And now you run. Run, run, run. Run, run, Rudolph. Wait, just in the middle. Just in the middle. Now you go for it. Okay, good, good, good. Making progress. Oh my goodness. All this for a sock. Oh my goodness, finally. I didn't even show everything because it just took me like 10 minutes to do that. So I just started recording it just as I jumped over. You really got to jump to here, wait for that guy to pass by on top. Then you go, you run, and then you got to go here. You got to weave in and out as this guy weaves in and out. It's very, that was one of the toughest things I've had to do so far in this game. But we got the sock, anything for the sock. Now we move to the rolling ball area. Okay, what's going on here? The big roller derby? Guess there's gonna be a lot of ball rolling. There's a golden spatch just wide you open. Just Thank you for that. Oh, it's in a little uh, Look, holder. Boy, there's gold under that glass. Gold, I say. Huh. My eyes are getting sweaty just looking at it. Huh. All you have to do is get that great big ball into that there cup. Okay. How do I get the ball rolling, Mr. Krabs? You start the process by bubble bowling up this ramp to hit that button. Good luck, SpongeBob. My wallet's counting on you. Okay. This is not going to be easy. If I remember correctly, I'm going to roll the ball. It's going to get to a certain point, and then it's going to fall to oblivion. I'm going to have to um, make small There's nothing like the changes smell each of time. In the morning. Also, that, that was button like... 404, by the way, for the Mermelair. This ball's going to start rolling. And probably have to, yeah, I'm going to have to change this thing. How do I change this? Uh, Like that? Oh, just in time. Okay. He comes through here. Then he drops off. Now I need to get... This somehow. Maybe I go like this? Uh, no. Gotta figure this guy out. What does this guy do? How do I make him turn? That's the only thing I gotta figure out. I walked through the entire thing. And I think I got it all down. But I just gotta figure out this guy. Oh, there you go. He's got a bowl. You have to bowl it. Now I'm stuck. Okay. Got a bowl. Okay, so let's try it again. I think I know what to do this time. So let's see if this is the moment of truth. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Okay. Smells like Showtime. Victory. Here comes the ball. 
This guy's gonna come down here, and he's going to drop here. So we won't want to wait too long. We won't want to do it too early either. Okay, we hit him there. Now right away we run over here. Get on top of this hammer. Go over here. Turn him. Okay. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. He comes over here. Scoop successful. Perfect. That's what we like to see. Now he's gonna come over here. Come on, come on, come on. Hit that. So he's gonna... Okay, he's gonna roll around town for a little bit. I still have some time. Okay. Here we go. He goes up there. Destroy that guy. Now I gotta run, 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 run. Make sure this is open. Ooh, just in time. Okay. Hit you. I don't know what this does, but I'm gonna hit it. Oh, it makes it go higher. Then this will direct it in. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Ah! I didn't want to do that. Wait, I did want to do that? Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to go there. Ah! Okay, one more time. We almost had it. Come on. Come back here. What are you doing? Why do you go in there every time? It's like I'm playing on one of those mazes, those ball mazes on Survivor. Come on, come on, come on, get out of there. There we go, now back here. Up here, come on, come on. Oh my goodness, you get out of one, you go from... Oh, did I see something there, like a sock or something? Out of the oven and into the frying pan. Oh, here's a sock, that's cool. This I got that. Come on, come on, get in there. Oh, okay, no wait, come on. Yes, thank you so much, that took like 20 minutes. The fan is going. Now I can, uh... Hit this button. Oh, hold on. Don't tell me it was too late or something. What? Okay, run, run, run. Come on, sponge. Hit that. Hit that. Oh my goodness. Yes, just got a bronze trophy as well. Keep it rolling. Wow, I remember I could never do that on the PS2 original game. That was one of the spatulas that I just never got. It only took like half an hour of my life, but there we go. A spatula well earned as we are a third way through the golden spatulas with number 33. Does Krabs have anything to say to me well for all my done, hard work? SpongeBob. Yeah, thanks. Now, how's about to hold Mr. Krabs that shiny gold? I'll give you promotion. Sorry, a promotion. Bells. Sure. You'll get a whole extra 10 seconds added no. to your break time. Woo! 20 <laughs> second break! Do I dare? <laughs> uh, no, I'm sorry, Mr. Krabs. As enticing as that sounds, I can't give this to you. I need every golden spatula I can get. I understand, boy. I'll just dock 30 <laughs> seconds from your break time instead. Whoa! That means I have a negative 20 second break. Thanks, Mr. Krabs. Tough working conditions called the uh, CSST or whatever. All right, that's finally done. We're getting close to finishing the, the Mermelair now. We'll go back to that main computer now that we've pressed all the buttons. Okay, can I press this button now? Is it gonna allow me to press the button? How do I speak to the computer I here? Hello. Of the security system. Here is the reward I promised you. You have pressed nice. all the security buttons. Now press the master shutdown button. Perfect. All worked out. That's number 34. We're just uh, swimming in golden spatulas today. So let me just zoop. Master shutdown. We did it, boys. The Mermelair is safe. Oh, of course. It's, I gotta go through this um, this bridge over here. After this, after I pressed the button, this bridge came up. What's this sign say? Press. Okay, yeah, we did that. All right. Now we can finally walk through this special bridge to Terabithia, the villain containment system area. This will be the last golden spatula. A bit of a longer episode as we did the entire Mermelair, but better than two like 15-minute videos. Especially someone who wants to. Find help for the entire thing. All its glory. Of course. Now, well, Justin Boy, you also cut the power to the Mermelayer's BCS. No. That's villain containment system. Is that bad? Does Mermaid Man smell like sour milk? Yes. Yes, I do. Oh no. It looks like one of the villains is broken free. What's that? An evil doer on the loose? Who is it? Man Ray! The atomic flounder! The dirty bubble! All terrible. Oh, worse than that. No. He's your arch enemy. 
Prawn. Prawn. <laughs> Con. Did someone call? Oh, aye, aye, aye. I thought maybe I was looking at superheroes, but now I see it's just a couple of pieces of now driftwood. Got him. Prawn. I'll never forgive you, you madman. What did Prawn do? The worst thing you can imagine. He put all a mermaid man's white clothes in the washer with a red sock. Diabolical. Everything I own turned pink. Pink. How horrible! Personally, I thought pink made you very pretty. Really? Sure, pretty stupid. <laughs> Got him. Yikes. What is that yellow thing? Some kind of mold? I'm not mold, I'm a sponge. There's a cellular difference. Mm. A cellular difference! And don't forget yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the lesson, Dr. Science. See you later, Pinky. By the seven seas, Prawn, I shall not rest until you are captured. But first, I shall have to change from my secret identity into Mermaid Man. You don't have a secret identity, you old coot. <laughs> Maybe you better take care of Prawn while I take care of this. I He's shall gone. avenge you, Mermaid Man. Avenge him, boys. Let's do it. Okay, so we gotta, we gotta be careful of the dance floor, and he's sending some sort of uh, supersonic sound waves there. You're not gonna outrun it, so you gotta jump over it. Oh my goodness, not gonna, yeah, don't even try to get through there. How am I... yeah, okay, now his shields come down. Can I come in? Please? Oh. That was... Uh, how am I supposed to get in there? Oh, I'm probably, uh, I probably have to bowl down that lane. That's what I gotta do. I gotta, gotta bowl uh, a strike right down the middle. Okay, here we go. Right down the middle. Bing! There we go. Do that a couple more times. Oh, no. Now he's sending out some boys. Bro, the guy only has so much, uh, power to just blow down, uh, blow that tube. Zoop! Right down the middle again. One more life. This guy's not too bad. Mermaid Man, you couldn't take him out? The old boy. Bing! Bong! Oh, that was close. Almost fell off the edge. Hey! Ah, oh, man, come on, the guy with the ha the lamppost got in the way here of me trying to hit, um... Now I gotta redo the whole thing, the lamppost getting in the way of me trying to hit the guy with the robot with the ham. Okay, one life left. What I wanna know is how he has enough tidal volume to keep blowing out all those bubbles. Combo city. There we go. Let's do it, thanks for letting down your shield. And now we... Bing! Oh, come on. Bing! Oof, are you serious? So the key is to just jump over his stream, because if you outrun his stream, bing. If you keep outrunning him, he's just going to keep following you. If you just keep going back and forth, jumping over his stream, it just takes about four jumps. And he'll let down his, um, he'll let down his shield pretty quickly. That's how you got to get out. That's how you got to do it nice and fast. Frankie. Frankie Biggs. I found this in my sock drawer. I mean, it's nice to be a millionaire. a bunch of pink socks. It's another golden spatula. Thank you, I miss the original voice from Mermaid Man. I always live my life by your shining example. Mm -hmm. Gone. Like goodness and kindness. Are you still here? Uh, all right, thanks for the spat, Bell. Number 35, that is Shrimp Catcher. Another bronze trophy in the books here for the Mermelair. Uh, I don't think there's anything left to do over here. We've completed completed all the spatulas and the socks and the buttons. So that is 100% completion of the Mermelair. Looking here just to confirm. Yeah, all the spatulas and all that good stuff. So we're going to head back to Bikini Bottom to finish this one off. So Shady Shoals is 100%ed, we don't need to go back in there. Next episode we will head into Sandy's Tree Dome, and then we can hit Rock Bottom, and then Sand Mountain, slowly going through it one location at a time. So hopefully the walkthrough of the Mermelair was helpful for you. If you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button, putting out lots of NHL, FIFA, and more walkthrough guides for how to 100% complete SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. So thank you once again so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.